And now we... Ah! Hey guys, what's up? What's up? Okay guys, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to build a bazooka. Yes guys, this is a VBP capable bazooka, but... Um, this is not a huge bazooka, okay? So this is a bazooka that you can attach to your body. So yes, there you go. So let's start now, okay? So let's change the merging level, okay? And then the move into two, all right? So uh, uh, gotta put blocks here. By the way, guys, uh, this is actually the first time that I'm going to do this. So I might do some mistakes, but you know, uh, uh, I want to do it now so that you know it's like we are doing this together okay we are in this guys we are in this both of us uh, will do this so we both gonna do some mistakes you know but it's okay it's you know it's some kind of a bonding with you guys okay <laughs> all right so gotta put some blocks okay one two three all right so let me see my height oh, yeah I think this is enough Hey, so this is just gonna be a guide, okay? So I'm gonna turn it black, so that is just the guide because we are going to put 24 blocks because, of course, bazooka is like a tube, right? So we are going to make a round blocks or round object, okay? So to do that, we need to change rotation to 15, okay? And then first, uh, we are going to make rotations like this. So just follow this, guys. So one two three four five six okay now we are done we can now put one block okay and then the second block we must rotate uh one time okay so one and then rotate okay so we have two blocks so guys uh to make a round object or a tube we need 24 blocks and with those 24 blocks every time we put one block we need to rotate okay just one rotation okay so we got one two and then three all right see i rotated again okay then four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, all right, 24 blocks, guys, 24 blocks to complete a perfect circle or round object, okay? So, there you go, and then uh, we need to, you know, of course, the size of bazooka, we must see, perhaps we can use a uh, 0.4, yes, let, let's see point three. Because we are going to shrink the height of this all of these blocks, okay? Uh, point three, I think it's too big. Perhaps point four. Yes, I think point four will do. All right, right. Point four. All right. So uh, we are going to reduce the height of all these blocks, okay? So uh, sorry, fat boy, I cannot let you join right now because. I am uh, recording. Yes, yeah, sorry, fat boy. I hope you watch the video and you hear my apologies. Okay, so all right. So we are reducing the height of this, uh, all these blocks, guys. Uh, all right. So we are using the point of the top of the blocks. Okay, as you can see, we started here at the top of this block. Okay, so we just following the direction of the spiral. So that's how we reduce the height okay of these blocks okay because we make some rotations guys right so with in with this block this is actually the top okay uh, there you go it's easy it's really easy guys but you know sometimes you might get bored doing this because it's a repeated action a repeated process and you must do it carefully because uh, you just uh, you don't want to shrink it twice right so because if you uh, shrink it twice it's gonna be a mistake so I gotta save it okay so yes I actually prepared the save slot for it so it's the bazooka uh, bazooka save slot all right I think I can use uh, 0 0.2 okay to reduce the size of these uh, blocks all right so there you go 
And good thing I save it because I am now lagging. I might get disconnected. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. All right, there you go, there you go. All right, all right. Ah, yes, yes, it's lag. It's it's the problem here in my country. Yeah, it always the internet is oh, is very very problematic. I could have finished this by now, uh, but because of the lag, yeah. So I'm having delays. So sorry for that, guys. <laughs> yes. So I think I I'll save it. Okay. So guys, again, uh, use zero point two to shrink all of this. Okay, okay, so I might, uh, yeah. Wait, I will just reconnect. <laughs> okay, guys, we are back. I am back. I hope the internet uh, is okay now. Okay, so we are using 0 0.2, right? And reducing these blocks, the size of these blocks. Okay, okay, please, internet. Be good to me, internet. Oh, yes, yes. I think it's, it's still lagged, but uh, it's better. Thank you, internet. Please do not disconnect me. <laughs> okay, there you go. There you go. By the way, guys, if you are not yet subscribed, please subscribe now and click the notification bell. And please like and share the video. Alright, there you go. And another one here. There you go. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> there you go. Alright. Yes, I think. Oh, 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 yes. Um, wait a minute. Is this even correct? I think I made a mistake here. Well, I'll just uh, bring this back to its uh, original size. And then, yeah, I, I believe I made a mistake here. Yeah, like, um, I'm going to to use point 0.4 again to shrink these blocks I think yeah uh, yes 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 I think uh, maybe it's because of the lag I forgot to shrink them okay the thing is this one yeah I believe it's correct now anyway I will I will see it later okay so I'm um, going to use sub two, okay. So I'm just gonna pull the blocks like this. Okay, so this is uh, where we are going to make the round object smooth, okay. So we are going to perhaps use point nine for this. All right, all right. I think point nine will do because we are going to reduce the width of these uh, blocks, okay. So there you go. Both sides, guys, left and right you should reduce its width okay yeah there you go so yes i believe this is there's a little difference as you can see but it's okay it's uh, hardly noticeable okay so all right so using 0 0.9 we are going to reduce the width of all these blocks everything guys these 24 blocks Ooh, and i want to save again guys sorry for the interruption because the internet might uh, get angry again and disconnect me <laughs> yeah but actually I'm the one who's gonna get angry with the internet all right there you go there you go oh oh this one look at that it's logging there you go all right especially I'm doing this during afternoon so Yes, it's the internet during afternoon in my country is really, really uh, difficult or slow because of the number of people that uses the internet. All right, the internet company is, you know, they're not doing their job properly, I think. <laughs> All right, yes, just a few more blocks. Okay. There you go. By the way, guys, uh, we have two channels. So uh, uh, this channel, of course, Hawks Dad Gaming, and the other channel, my original channel, is It's an Hawk Toys and Adventure. So please subscribe there too, okay? 
All right, almost done. Almost done. All right, there you go. So, what we are go? I think yeah. I think this is another mistake here. All right. Yes, that will do. So yes, guys. There you go. Everything is in order now. So they are now in spiral form. Okay. So we are going to pull all these blocks. Okay. I think I want to start here now. So I want to. Uh, I just want to uh, stand beside this. Okay. I I, I want to know how long will the is the bazooka is gonna be. So one, two, three, four. Yeah, I think four. Four blocks, something like that. So the size should be eight, okay? Or the length should be eight, okay? There you go. And then, okay, so we are going to pull these blocks. There you go. And here. And this one, okay? So the thing is, all these blocks, guys, all of these 24 blocks, we are going to pull this like this up to this uh, guide and then we're gonna reduce the length to eight okay so i'm gonna save it again because the internet might get crazy again <laughs> okay by the way guys uh sorry for my english because english is not my first language not my main language so I'm, you know, I'm just trying my best to speak English so that many of you can understand what I'm saying or what I'm doing. Okay, there you go. And I hope you really understand me, guys. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Anyway, you can see what I'm doing. So I think even without speaking, I think you can still follow the direction of what I am doing but uh, anyway this is a very fast build so it's easy very easy to build right all right yes and I can now see the size of the tube and I believe we did a good job I think this is just the perfect size for the bazooka because guys, this bazooka will be attached to the to our body. I mean, the player's body, right? And it can be used for PvP. So later, if you don't know, guys, the glitch. So we are going to use the glitch on how we are going to attach this to our body. So you will see, guys. You will see. All right, we are almost done. Well, actually, the, the tube is the most important part here, so this is actually, because this is the main part of the bazooka, of our bazooka, right? So, yep, I think this is good. All right, there you go. So, I believe the bazooka, I mean, uh, I, I believe this is US built bazooka, but I believe it doesn't have, you know, the hand grip or the handle. So, yeah, I'm not going to put a hand grip for this. Alright. So, but of course, the design, I believe. Okay, wait. I will just look at it uh, on the internet. Okay, okay. So, yes, yeah, gonna make it easier for you guys. Okay. So, change. Uh, blah, blah, I gotta save this first, okay? Because the internet might get crazy again. Alright, change the move into two, okay? And anyway, I want to use another texture. So guys, overall, this is 24 blocks, okay? So as you can see, very few blocks, okay? So I want to use uh, concrete blocks, you know, for other texture, something like that. All right, so got to put this. I told you guys, this block is very important because it's the guide, okay? So uh, let's use 0.6. There you go. And then perhaps 0 0.2, there you go. Then shrink this like that, okay? So, so you see, this is how it should look. By the way, this is not the, this is not gonna be the exact copy of 
the bazooka, okay? But uh, I mean, very, very, we're gonna make it very, very close, okay? I think, and I believe we can shrink it furthermore. Yeah, there you go. And I believe I can add more. And then let's use point, uh, point 0.5 for this. I want this a little bigger. There you go. Oops, let's use point 0.1 for this. Then 2. Then perhaps we can use point 0.5. All right, there you go, and then maybe let's go back to point one. There you go, and I want to reduce this a little. All right, there you go. Right, right, cool, right. Okay, and then uh, let's just uh, put something for targeting. There you go, I think, yeah, we're gonna use point uh, 9, perhaps. There you go, yeah, perfect. And then point 1, I think this will do. Alright, so just make an adjustment like this. Okay, and then perhaps we can uh, shrink this. Yeah, 0 0.8 will be the height of this. Okay. And then, we're gonna add more, oops, like that, I think, that will do, oops, no, wait. Alright, let's use uh, point 0.9 for this, let's shrink this, yep, okay, I think that will, uh, let's use point 0.1, and then point 0.9, okay. Anyway, uh, this thing is not that much important so it's up to you on what size would this block will be and eight yeah this will be the same end okay and what I'm go oh wait 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 yes yes there should be a hole okay so I think this is good this one I'm gonna make adjustment for this so this is 0 0.8 wait okay and then gotta put blocks again like that well I believe I can just shrink it like this right and then pull it all right all right so th they're gonna be just the same I gotta ch change here make adjustments here all right there you go yes perfect guys so this should be the position of these uh, blocks okay and then well let's just use so this point one blocks i mean point one scale number okay so in reducing this block okay so this is how we are going to do this then shrink 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 then shrink look at that all right perfect perfect all right there you go this is actually we can say that this is actually done already <clears throat> yes all right all right so there you go i believe there's something oh wait 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 i heard a harpoon so i might uh, so i should turn on block request and isolation mode okay <clears throat> all right so i just want to add some more details perhaps these uh, metal blocks so uh anyway by the way this is not that important so if you want to follow this it's okay but if not it's okay just wanna add you know some extra texture for this bazooka okay so i wonder where's the press button for the bazooka like this okay maybe yeah by the way I, I i told you this is not gonna be the exact copy so i believe we can put it there so i'm using wood you know for another different texture 
there you go I think this will do yeah I'm gonna use 0 0.05 all right there you go so this will serve as the button okay so this is the button that you know uh, not the real button okay but the button just for the design okay and then uh, we, let's change the color to green okay all right beautiful right beautiful so now it looks like a real bazooka huh? <laughs> all right i want to change the color of this and then perhaps this is dark brown something like that then the wood would be gray and uh, it's not centered there you go so I'm gonna save it all right there you go but this one guys do not delete this okay and then the thing is this one is also important guys because this is gonna be the bazooka is actually done now all right so uh, uh right there you go oops nope nope i want to use this dark or maroon okay very good guys very good oh oh what's this oh because they have different color there you go there you go perfect beautiful gotta save it again all right and then this is now we are going to make the uh the bullet something like that or the explosive yeah or the rocket something like that okay there you go so all right uh, i want to make it lighter so we are going to use plastic blocks okay so this time we are going to put six blocks okay let's start with the back okay so change rotation and then rotate like this so one two three four five six and then one and then rotate two three four five six so we only need six blocks guys and then oh wait the color of this and then okay we are going to shrink this uh, perhaps we can use point six for this <coughs> Uh, 0.6, I believe 0.6 is too big. Maybe, yeah, this, I think this is safe to use 0.8. Okay, 0.8, I think, yeah, 0.8 will be perfect. Okay, so I just want to check if it doesn't touch. Yes, it doesn't touch the bazooka itself. So I believe this is good or... I hope so I hope so so anyway this is just six blocks if we made a mistake then we can just reduce it again okay so yes guys this is gonna be the rocket or the bullet or the ammo yeah yeah that's the term the ammo of this bazooka okay so what we are going to do is all right, so gonna make this transparent first so that we can see if this bazooka. Oh, look at that! There is actually some mistake here. Wait, I uh, wanna reduce it now. Okay, there you go. <coughs> all right, all right. There you go. So let's pull these blocks. Okay. Yeah, same size as the bazooka or same length as this bazooka itself, okay? I'm not really sure uh, if this is the same size of uh, the ammo of the real bazooka, but as I've said, this is not the exact copy, so I think this will do for us. What important is the capability of this bazooka will be all right perfect yes perfect guys perfect so we can now change this change it back to transparency zero hey 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 come on and yeah i want to save it because 
It might get lag again. <laughs> okay, there you go. <clears throat> okay, the next step is we are going to put another block. Okay, perhaps this is point 0.9. Yeah, this will surely work with point 0.9. Okay. So, we're gonna pull this like this, okay? And then, yeah, I believe that would be okay. And then, I will just uh, adjust this. Okay, actually, we do, uh, I, I believe this is the final step. I, I believe we don't need this anymore, but... Uh, we're, uh, I'm not sure, so uh, I just make some adjustment on it, okay? So there you go. Change it to black. Actually, guys, uh, we are almost done. Okay, so the next step is we are going to put thruster. So uh, you can use this thruster if you want, but I have ultra thruster, so I will use ultra thrusters. But any thrusters will do, guys. So you're gonna add it here. Yeah. And yeah, I, I believe we can delete this now, okay? So uh, you can actually even make it too, okay? And then dynamite, of course, we are going to put dynamite. There you go. So wait, right there you go, and then change to 15. I want to put some multiple dynamites 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I have 10 dynamite, so I want to put, uh, to make it even power, powerful, so I want to put a lot, something like that. So maybe, yeah, I'll just use plastic blocks. So this is just going to be another guide, okay? So that we can attach the dynamite properly. So to add uh, multiple dynamites, guys, wait, wait, okay, there you go, so zoom in. I gotta zoom in like this. Wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> it should be perfectly zoomed. I think, yeah, this will do. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, there you go, guys. Look at that. <laughs> All right. So there you go. That's a lot of dynamite, right? then uh, I put it that way you can actually just use one okay guys but uh, I have 10 dynamites and I want to maximize the power of this bazooka so that's how I do it so I put the bazooka I mean the dynamites like this guys because of course we are going to make this transparent okay all of this okay because the bazooka will be ugly if there's a visible large dynamite in front right it doesn't look it doesn't look realistic so we gonna make it transparent okay last one Hey, where is it? Alright, and also this, guys. Don't worry about this. Uh, wait, wait. This thing should not be touching the bazooka, okay? So, let's make some adjustment. Okay, there you go. So, this we can make invisible. We, oh, actually, we can delete this and then just extend this like that, okay? And of course, guys, we are also going to make this uh, stick invisible. So, gonna pull this like this so that it will surely, it will uh, surely attach to the thrusters. All right, transparency and 100 and collision. Also, this, then collision. 100% transparency and then collision. So, as you can see, right the collision is off you can pass through except for the dynamites oh yes 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 uh collision i should have removed the collision of this earlier sorry about this guys 
but it's very easy don't worry there you go <coughs> there you go uh, there is still some there is still some uh, dynamite that the collision is still on where is it uh, it's really hard to see anyway yeah uh, guys you should make the collision of all the dynamites off because I can see it now it's really hard <laughs> and anyway yeah alright anyway uh, let's go to the other step okay so this is the time we are going to attach this okay because we are going to use of course the cake glitch and we gonna oh wait gonna save it first yeah sorry about that so we are going to sit let's see all right so what we're going to do is well let's just uh add blocks like that and then put the chair hey 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 what the <laughs> I don't, by the way i want to load this first to make sure everything is attached okay and yes yeah sorry guys i made another mistake yeah i forgot we should add button okay there you go so this button guys uh, you add one button first so that you know when we put this button wait oh there's one dynamite who is attached to the button oh no 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 all right there you go so we do that guy oh really come on you don't want this uh oh my goodness <laughs> all right all right i wonder what this block is uh you don't want any dynamite attached to it because uh we don't want the dynamite we don't want dynamites when we i mean if we press this dyn the dynamites will explode so that's gonna be a huge problem so wait uh i believe we can just do this so this is 10 right three ah it's really really dynamites are really difficult to look okay one two three four five six seven eight nine yeah there is another one who is actually inside how can i click it ah oh, it's really hard all right so now everything is attached now one two three four five six seven eight nine ten or right. oops ten all right finally what they're still connected one two three four five six oh how can i click the i think i should start here so one two three four five six yeah the dynamite at the center is the hardest uh dynamite to click all right there you go finally got it all right got you boy yes finally guys finally every every dynamite is now connected to the disconnected to this block okay so what we're going to oh yes i forgot 
we should also add this okay this is very important too guys the glue okay so this is glue right so we're gonna just attach it yeah I think that will do nope I don't want that to be touching the yeah that will do okay so we can just turn the transparency so we need that glue guys so that the ammo will not, when we uncheck anchor the ammo will not uh, just fall okay so we are going to attach it okay so this one is attached already and then the thrusters yes we are going to attach the thrusters Okay guys, I'm back and my recorder had a problem so I'm using my mobile phone now to record this so sorry for the audio but I just want to finish this because the, we are almost done and by the way guys, I actually had some uh, trials, series of trials and yes guys, I have to admit I have lots of mistakes in doing this and the, I believe I don't have enough, I did not put enough thrusters so what I'm going to do is I'm going to add more okay perhaps five thrusters okay so there you go so one two three four five okay so the collision should be off and then transparency 100% and cast shadow okay and I want to make sure all of these are attached to the bottom three four five and then there you go okay all right and also i reduced the dynamite because i believe dynamites have some weight so from 10 i just removed it to one to make sure that the ammo will fly properly okay so gotta save it first so now i'm using five ultra thrusters okay because guys the problem that i encounter is that uh i think it doesn't have enough trust because maybe the ammo is heating or that when you launch it when i launch it i think the ammo is having some you know it, it touches the bazooka that's why the trust has been reduced okay so all right so let, this is how we are going to attach this all right there you go then reduce it using just one okay and then move to 0 0.5 i think this will do yeah perfect this is perfect okay and then we are going to put blocks here all right so just want to make sure this block is attached properly to the bazooka okay so I made some adjustment to make sure look at that it's a touch but make sure this block doesn't touch the ammo and then we are going to reduce this to one okay because this is the same size as the uh, I mean the same height as the cake and we are going to add block here all right uh, and then we are going to use the cake so this is where we are going to attach the cake so that we can ensure that or we are we can a we will be able to attach the cake to this block and to the body okay so now we can delete this and then we can change the transparency to 100 percent all right so let us try this now and all right so everything i think is in order there you go all right there you go <clears throat> there you go so let's try I hope it works properly now all right let's try to shoot this all right three two one fire oh yes oh yes Woo! did you see that guys did you see that it fires properly all right it actually bounced back to me oh yes 
finally got it. I finally got it. Yes, yes. All right, all right. So let's try it again. Let's try it again. All right. So there you go. I will uh, just load it again. Okay. Yes. Whoa. All right. So we gotta try to shoot. Uh, we gotta try to shoot it to the other base. All right. So there you go. Reduce this. Okay. I'm so excited, guys. I'm so excited. All right. There you go. I mean, yeah, yes. Perfect. Good. 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 All right. And then attach the, you need to attach this okay let's use 0 0.5 again oops that's too much all right there you go and then change the move to one oh uh, yeah there is a problem there why is it not should yeah there you go Anyway, it's okay. Let's use 0 0.2. Just make sure this block is attached to this bazooka, okay? I already taught you the process earlier, so just follow it again. Alright, alright. So this time we are going to fire this to the other base. Alright, there you go. Alright, so uncheck anchor. What? What happened there? Alright, just load it again. No problem, no problem. Just load it again and just do that uh, process again. Okay, it's okay. <laughs> Alright, there you go. And then, of course, the block. Alright, and then 0.05. Alright, there you go. And then shrink. Alright, and then where is the cake? So, yes, there you go. I'm sure this will work. And then, and then transparency collision or should I no 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 need for me to do that okay so uncheck all right there you go everything is in order now all right there you go so yes we got the thrusters attached the dynamite I think we can now fire this to the other base so we will see fire <laughs> Fire! Oh, look at that! Yes! All right! Yeah! Did you see that, guys? All right! Woo! That's really awesome, guys. That's really, really awesome. All right, guys. It finally works. So now you can do this for PvP, something like that, and it really fires, guys. I'm so happy. I'm. Uh, this is done. It's finally over <laughs> all right so thank you for watching guys and by the way if you are not yet subscribed please subscribe now and click the notification bell and please like and share the video thank you for watching guys bye bye